Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Andy, AKA Call Sign Keebs. And in this video, I wanted to show off this tactical vest from a company called Fire Gear on Amazon. All right, so at the bottom of the vest, there are three spots for pistol magazines. Um, to me, it looks like you could probably fit two magazines in each one. Um, and it's held together by Velcro. Now, some people might not like Velcro because of the noise it makes, but I figure if you're transitioning to your sidearm anyway, you're most likely already in a gun battle, so the noise from the Velcro shouldn't be your main concern. And I really don't think it's gonna be a tactical disadvantage. Moving up, there are a few spots here for uh, your M4 magazines. As you can see, they are all held in by like bungee cords. All you have to do is pull that aside, your magazine comes out, it's really quick and easy to access. So what's nice too is that on this vest on the sides, there are other spots for your M4 mags. One on my right hip, but the other spot is for my radio, just so it's easy to access and all the wires and everything are out of the way. Now on the sides of the vest, there is extra storage. Um, there's moles on the outside, and then also a Velcro uh, part for extra storage, whatever it may be. All right, so if you look on the side of the vest, there's like this quick release tab. Basically you pull the string and it is um, a quick release. It allows you to get in and out of the vest within seconds. It's on both sides. And then you'll see in another clip, it's up on the shoulders as well. All right, so moving to the mid portion of the vest, you'll see that there's several attachment spots for uh, anything mole based. But you'll see on my right shoulder, I have my dead rag. On the left, I have uh, my radio attached. And right in the middle, there is a spot for uh, Velcro. So that's typically where morale patches go. So moving up, you can see that there's also the quick release up here. It's just a quick and easy way to get in and out of your vest. So moving up, there are shoulder pads on this vest. And what's nice is they're adjustable, so you can um, kind of either move them forward or back and adjust it to your comfort. Inside of the vest is made out of some breathable uh, nylon, I believe. Now moving to the back, I actually installed a uh, mini map bag, or I guess you could call it a tactical bag. Uh, the reason why I bought this is for extra storage. If you are playing CQB or like Milsim or something, there's all the attachment points for smoke or grenades. Um, and it also can hold a three liter hydration pack, which is great. 